This is the sixth video in a series intended to help you use the features of the FamilySearch Research Wiki to successfully find records for your ancestors in Germany. Prior to 1871, there wasn't a Germany. There were many small countries. The boundaries for those countries and the names of those countries were constantly in flux. In 1871, all these little countries were unified into Germany. And the little countries became provinces or states. All the towns in Germany at that time are found in the 1871 Myers Gazetteer. All the records in the family search system are found by the name of the town and its province in the 1871 Myers Gazetteer. As Germany lost the two world wars, parts of Germany were given to Poland, Russia, Czechoslovakia, France, and Lithuania. Germany was split into East and West Germany. Eventually, of course, East and West Germany were reunited. All of the little principalities of Germany were reorganized into new states. The modern addresses within these 15 current states of Germany and in parts of Germany now in other countries are used when contacting churches or archives or civil registry offices. Here is the Germany genealogy main page. On this page, the goal of the maps and the jurisdiction lists are to act as an index to get you to the correct province page. It is in these province pages where you will find a wealth of detail on how to access the church and civil records that will make up the bulk of your research in Germany. The next lesson in this video series will teach you how to use these pages. The first map that you will see on the Germany genealogy main page shows Germany the way it is today. Click on the link in the clickable map or the jurisdiction list for the province you need. The second map you'll see on the main page informs you about the chunks of Germany that were given away in the treaties after World War I and World War II. Those changes are explained in greater detail in the list below the map. By clicking in an area on the map or on one of these links, you will be directed to the correct article in the wiki that will teach you how to access records for that region. The third map and accompanying list of jurisdictions show Germany as it was in 1871, matching Meyer's Gazetteer. So when you find your town in that Gazetteer, clicking on its 1871 province in this list will take you to the correct province page in the wiki. Now I will demonstrate how to use Myers Gazetteer online. You type the name of your town in the search box, and you'll be given a list of all the towns in Germany with that name. You choose the one that you want, and notice right here that Kitzingen is in Unterfranken Bayern, which is Bavaria. That will be the province page that I look for. I now go back to the Germany genealogy main page, Find Bavaria in this list. It gives both the English and German names, so this will be where you figure out that Bayern is Bavaria. And click there, and I will be taken to the page for Bavaria, Germany. Let's look at a different kind of example for Breslau. We learned that it is in Schlesien, Preussen. In the map of the Germany genealogy main page, you don't see Schlesien in the first map. You find it in the list for the second map, where you see that in English it's Silesia, and you can see on the map that Silesia was lost to Poland in 1945. As you look at the third map in jurisdiction list, which deals with Germany as it was in 1871, you see that Schlesien was an original province in Germany at that time. You can click on it from the second and third maps and lists to learn how to do genealogy in Silesia or Schlesien. Here's the third thing you might see. For Jena, you will see that it is in Sachsen, Weimar, Eisenach. 
Saxon Weimar Eisenach will only show up on the third list because it was consolidated into the state of Thuringia, but it is gone now. Clicking on the link for Saxon Weimar Eisenach takes you to the article for Thuringia. And within that article, you will find instructions for all the little principalities that were combined into Thuringia, including Saxon, Weimar, Eisenach. Now you try it. Locate your ancestor's town in Meyer's 1871 Gazetteer. Using the information from that Gazetteer, check the three maps on the Germany genealogy main page. Locate your province in those maps. Now you have used the maps to find the wiki province page where your town of origin was. Go on to the next lesson where you will learn how to effectively use that province page.